Howdy, howdy. My name is John, and this video is a combination of a monthly wrap-up for the month of July 2020, a reading update for the week ending August 1st, 2020, and then my August 2020 TBR. If you've been watching my weekly videos, I'll leave a timestamp in the description below to where you can skip to my weekly update uh, in this video. I want to keep doing monthly videos because I know some people will only have time to watch one video a month from me, and so this way they can catch up on what I've been reading this month. First, I read The Mammoth Hunters by Jean M. All. This is book three in her Earth Children series. For the most part, I enjoyed this book. There's a, a portion uh, where the two main characters don't really talk to one another. They're not talking their problems through, and that annoyed me. But uh, overall, I enjoyed this book. I gave it four, uh, four out of five stars. I also read The Catcher in the Rye. I picked this book up because I've heard, you know, this book is a classic. I've heard good things about it, but I did not enjoy this one. I only gave it one star. The writing style just didn't work for me. Then I read Encyclopedia Brown and the Case of the Secret Pitch. This is one of the books that I loved when I was a kid. And after the disappointment of reading in The Catcher of the Rye, I went ahead and picked this one up. This is a good uh, children's book. It uh, it follows uh, its ten separate cases that Encyclopedia Brown uh, solves, and there's always a, a clue hidden somewhere in the story. And, if you can spot that clue, you solve the mystery. So, again, it was just nice to pick up something from uh, when I was a kid. I finished Iron John, a book about men by Robert Bly this month. In this book, Robert Bly takes the grim story, Iron John, or in some translations it's called Iron Hans, and analyzes the fairy tale to see how it instructs us on how boys become men. This was a reread for me, and I really enjoyed this reread. I, I gave this one five stars. I also finished Tuck Everlasting this month. This is another reread for me. I, I first read this back when I was in the ninth grade, and it's a book that stuck with me over the years. Again, another five-star reading. This week, I finished the DVD course, Analysis and Critique, how to engage and write about anything. Uh, I picked this up because as I am starting to do book reviews, I wanted to uh, really learn how to analyze literature a little bit better. However, this is more of a writing course. Really, the subtitle of this course should be the title of the course, but it's actually a really good writing uh, course. So uh, overall, I would give this four stars. I'm still reading The Plains of Passage by Jean M. All. This is book four of the Earth Children series. I'm on page 679, and there's a little over 800 pages in this, so hopefully I will get finished with this this month. This is the first book on my August TBR. And then as far as my August TBR, I'm planning on alternating between the Earth Children series and the Earthsea Trilogy series. I've already read the first book in this series, A Wizard of Earthsea, so I'm going to alternate between this and uh, Earth Children until I've finished uh, the Earth Children series. And then I'm not sure what I'll pick up after that. Two nonfiction books that I plan on reading this month are The Sibling Society by uh, Robert Bly. This book is actually the sequel to Iron John, and I, I was able to pick up a copy in a thrift store, so I'm looking forward to uh, reading this one. I also want to read Tuesdays with Maury by Mitch Albom. I've heard a lot of good things about this book, so I'm looking forward to reading this one as well. I do have a flower update this week. I meant to post these 
pictures with my weekly update last week, but I forgot to do it. So uh, I've got these. I don't know that I'll have any more flower pictures this year, though. Uh, maybe once the crepe myrtles bloom out, maybe I'll uh, picture those. But uh, as far as my flowers, they're kind of winding down. So we'll have to wait until next spring for those. Thank you for watching this video, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day.